हेलो गाइस वेलकम टू माय चैनल हेलो गाइस इन दिस वीडियो वी आर गोइंग टू लर्न हाउ वी कैन कॉन्फ़िगर एंड्रॉइड इमुलेटर इन एंड्रॉइड स्टूडियो फॉर इंटेल i3 i5 i7 सेवन एंड अबाउट जनरेशन प्रोसेसर दिस टेक्निक विल वर्क ऑन ओनली इंटेल i3 i5 i7 सेवन एंड अबाउट जनरेशन If you have AMD processor or the less generation than सेवन generation means you have a सिक्स फाइव फोर थ्री generation of processor, then you can use different technique that I will also show in different video. But in this video, I am showing the technique for this kind of processor. So we have to perform three tasks to run the emulator. First one, we have to enable Intel Virtual Technology in BIOS. then we have to install intel exim driver to boost up the virtual technology and then we have to create a emulator in android virtual devices so let's see what are the problem we face first time suppose i open the android studio first time and i go to avd this is the android virtual device manager whenever i go here and i try to create the avd just like this i'm creating emulator here and i press run you see there is a problem is coming here so this kind of problem is coming because the in bias we have disable the virtual technology of intel and by default this is disable in bias we need to or we have to enable this feature so how you can enable this feature i will show you in a this video see the steps how we can follow then after enabling the features we will start this video again for enabling a intel virtual technology in your laptop first of all you have to search out the hole as i am showing in this image and in just beside the hole we have the drop down arrow symbol just use the mobile sim pin that you used to pull out the sim from the mobile phone or you may have the all pin the stapler pin and use that pin and put that pin in this hole like this now laptop is started so it will show you the bias option so in this bias we have to go to the bias option and press enter and in this bias we have to search out the configuration in which we have the option intel virtual technology just enable this as in my pc you have seen i have enabled if this feature is enabled in your bias then you would be able to run the android studio emulator very fast and quickly so this is the must enable feature that we have to do for running a android studio emulator then enable it go to the exit and click on save changes and then just restart your laptop then by this way you will enable the intel virtual technology in your laptop so you have learned how you can enable the intel virtual technology in bias then what you have to do you have to go in this android studio and try to install the exim driver also means you have to complete the step number second to install the ha exim drivers to boost up the virtual technology so just go to the sdk manager here go to the sdk tool and try that try to select this on checkbox on and install this driver intel x86 exim installer in my pc it is installed but in your system maybe it is uninstall just check on this and click on the apply it will install it will take time it will give you the option to installation just install the exim driver now the after installation of exim driver now second step is over now we have to follow the third step to create the android emulator and test the software so just click on the create virtual device here and select here the 
pixel xl 5.5 screen size because this size is best and it run faster also then you see when i click on next button it does not show the vtx problem the vtx bias problem just select the emulator which you want to select as i am using the android 11 so you can make any whatever you want and if you want suppose uh, android 8 9 10 just now click on download so download the emulator from the android developer website it automatically it will download for you but in my pc only one is already downloaded 11.0 and in your system also it is the default installer image of the google just click on next and give the name whatever you want to give here and just leaving it just as usual do not try to select all the things if there is a by default is everything is ready just click on finish and it will show you the emulator here and click on this button and it will run your emulator it will start your emulator in first time it take little bit time but second time it run fast so it is showing in front of you the simulator it will take little bit of time you see it is coming so first time it take time in your machine it can take longer time also you see pixel is starting so you see now the screen of the simulator is shown in front of you just click on this green button to run the application and it will install the application on this emulator you see the output is coming hello world so this is the way to run the emulator and configure the emulator first time on android studio so follow these three steps if you follow these three steps automatically you would be able to run your emulator as i have run and configure in front of you thanks for watching my video